two. Fight. The mechanics in Soul Calibur V work similarly to other games within the franchise and in the 3D fighter genre. Each character has access to a variety of high, mid, and low attacks of varying range depending on their weapon, as well as short range but quick kicks. In order to block an incoming attack, the opposing player must quickly block in the direction he or she is receiving an attack. The game, as with most other games in the genre, tends to have a bit of a back and forth pace ultimately ending when a player missteps and receives a hit or a series of hits as a combo. Soul Calibur V also introduces a new feature in the franchise, the Soul Gauge. This Soul Gauge charges up throughout the duration of the battle, growing slightly when a player's attacks are connecting, and increasing rapidly when a player seems to be at a disadvantage. This allows for a player to make a comeback even when they seem to be down and out. While difficult to block, these critical edge attacks are able to be defended, which creates a balanced system for newcomers and veterans. Unfortunately for the player on the receiving end, if the critical edge is not blocked, the damage caused ranges anywhere from 30 to 50% of the maximum health bar, creating devastating results. 